And happening right now, our community is mourning the loss of two public servants. The Port Authority told Channel 11 two of their employees died due to complications from COVID-19. Both of the men, Patrick Hazlitt and Marlon Lucas, were husbands, fathers and friends. And tonight, Ryan Houston shows us what their loss means for our community. 57 year old Marlon Lucas was more than just a Port Authority bus driver. He was the rock of my ministry. He was the rock of our Christian fellowship. He was he was the rock. Pastor Milton Rayford says not only was Marlon a man of faith, he was a husband to his wife Dana of 33 years and a father to his two children. We're told last Wednesday Lucas went to the hospital after getting COVID-19. By Friday, he was on a ventilator and early Sunday morning he died. Marlon was the kind of guy that if if somebody came to church that was troubled and they were broken and they didn't have a father and he was like an oak tree, I would say sit next to Marlon because he'll provide the shade that you need, the comfort that you need. The Amalgamated Transit Union Local 85 family is also mourning the loss of 34-year-old Patrick Hazlett. He was a husband and father of four. Hazlett was also a bus driver who battled COVID-19 in the hospital for 10 days and then died this morning. One of his family members told me by phone that they believe he got the virus from driving the bus. They also tell Channel 11 that Patrick talked about how some passengers would actually cough in the face of bus drivers who told them to wear a mask. But Pastor Rayford says he believes a divine power parked Marlon Lucas's bus one last time. We are in mourning as a family. Uh, no doubt about it. We know that uh, Marlon's in heaven now, though. We know to be absent from the bodies, to be present with the Lord. Ryan Houston, Channel 11 News.